Hello everyone, my name is Somungri and I'd like to welcome you guys all back to more Sly Cooper Thieves in Time. In this episode, we have Salim in Heavy Metal Meltdown, but first, ThiefNet, it's ThiefNet, everyone's favorite and only store. We're going in, buying things, because we got lots of gold, we got the air smash, press triangle on the air, don't mind if I do. And is that all we can buy? Looks like that is all for now. Oh no, moving pickpocket we finally get with Bentley. Oh yeah. Anything else down here? Nothing else. Alright guys, let's do this with Salim in Heavy Metal Meltdown. Aw oh, yeah. Alright, here we are. We have freed his partners in crime, so now we are free to terrorize the city and steal whatever we please. And he's got kind of a purplish hue to his tail, which is kind of weird. But it's kind of cool that each Cooper ancestor has their own kind of color. So not only do raccoons steal from your garbage and eat your food, they come in all different shapes and sizes. So that's good to know. And we also have a magic carpet, which is also really nice to know. So I'm kind of curious to see how many more missions will be here since we did free our buddies and now we are kind of just hanging around waiting for the main heist. And hopefully we will stop the paradox. I know this is the last zone, but I'm sure he will have something up his sleeve for us. And that Miss Decimal, you never know what she's going to do either. Hopefully no mind control. So let's get this mission started with Salim. Alright Salim, I've disabled the security system in the village, but Miss Decibel has retreated to her private office above the library. We need to get in there so we can plant a bug and find out what's going on. However, my schematics show the building is heavily secured, and it appears only someone with your climbing ability can gain access. I do not understand. How will putting an insect in there tell us anything? At most, it will just annoy her. No, not that kind of bug. This is a small device that can transmit sound so we can listen to her conversation. Oh, does it also bite? Look, don't worry about the bug. Right now, I need you to find a way into that study so you can let me in. I'll take over from there. All right, Bentley. I will find a way inside while you play with your bug. Bentley loves his bugs, and hopefully they're not bed bugs, because those things bite! I don't know from experience or anything, but I have heard. And back in the day here, probably a lot worse. Bed bugs would definitely leave a mark and probably bug you throughout the night. Okay, Salim, I need you to plant that bug in Miss Decibel's office, but first we need to get her out of there. I've reprogrammed those transmitters she was using on your friends with some new music. Once you place them around the room and I activate them, she's gonna come running. How do you know this? Because she happens to be a music snob, and I'm about to give her a dose of something she can't stand. Good old rock and roll. I do not care for rocks and rolling either. No, it... Never mind. Just get those transmitters in place. Aw, oh, yeah. Salim doesn't care for rocks that are rolling. <laughs> that is awesome. I love how the ancestors always interpret it First kind of box, in a funny no way. Transmitters. Why do I have to carry all these things? Do I look like a camel? You don't look like a camel. Well, maybe. What's going on down here? Kind of crazy. Is there a mask anywhere? Hmm. Let's take a gander. What is that? Looks like we're going to have to travel over there soon. But why are all the papers flying? Why? Why so many? Oh well, let's go to this one first here. All this climbing is going to turn me into a monkey. Oh, Salim. 
You and your frame rate leg. You're not gonna turn into a monkey. What's going on here? Hmm. Secret, maybe? Don't know how to get back there. Maybe Bentley can blow that up, though. Oh, we gotta go up the books. And who said knowledge didn't lead you to higher levels of learning? Aw, oh, yeah. Bad joke. <laughs> but these books should be able to help us out. And these are some huge, huge books. Who are reading these things? Like, giants? This thing's waving back and forth. We gotta go this way? Oh, right here. Up to see Daisy. Whoa, 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 no, 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 no. Aw, oh, Salim, come on, bruh, come on. We climb to the top together and then you just fall. Really? Really? Up we go. He doesn't like books. Doesn't care much for education, I guess. Alright. There we are, finally. We're gonna go this way this time. And almost there. Magic carpet for the win. Good job, Salim. One down, two to go. Thank you, Bentley. Ooh, there's a slime mask. Slime mask. Can I get it? I don't know. We're gonna go for it, though. Knew there was a reason to go up here. Oh yeah. We got it. Number 51. Magic carpet down, in style. That would just be the best thing to own, a magic carpet. You know how cool you'd be just going to school in that or going to work? You're like, yeah, just gotta park my magic carpet right here, no big deal. Everybody else is like, oh, stupid sports car. Let's look around down here real quick. Why did my skill have to be climbing? Why not sleeping? Yes, yes, there is always one more thing, though, is there not? One more thing for Bentley. Indeed. This is a pretty easy mission thus far. Kind of waiting to see her reaction on what's going to happen here. Anything over here? Nope. What's with all these papers? What do they read? Anything? Hmm, too hard to tell. Alright, the last one's gotta be in here. I wonder if they have any good cookbooks in here. <laughs> this chains break so easily. Yeah, well, that kills you. To go on a diet. I think about it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, where to next? What's over there? <laughs> No! Magic carpet! Yes! Perfect, Salim. I'll take it from here. There. I hope you are happy. Please, just tell me there are no snakes involved. Once I activate those transmitters with my darts, Miss Decibel will be dancing to a different tune. Oh, <laughs> Bentley? You crazy turtle, you. What's going on here? Alright, we can go down there and bomb that. We also need to bomb this. Let's take a look at Miss Decibel. Doesn't look like she's playing too hard. Oops. No. Ah, shoot. Let's go down here first. Okay, the old dart gun is ready for action. Anything around here? I need a cup of tea. Right, that's how we get out of here, I believe. What is this book all about? Is that Bentley on there? It is! One of Bentley's ancestors, maybe? Who knows? Could be, and that's pretty cool. Bingo! Right on target! Alright, so where are we going next? I do know we have to go back up. 
And we also have to go to the one room with the bomb hole in it that we saw before, which was right there. Let's do this one first. Watch out for that hole. Never want to fall down something twice. And right here. Oh, yeah. Oh. I should have known it was you hideous hoodlums. Really? That's your toot? Alright, so we gotta hide after these. I know you're there, whoever you are. Go back to playing your music, sweet trunks. Come on. That wretched Cooper gang is playing my nerves. Alright, only a couple more here. Can we make the toss? Nope. Alright, so we're gonna have to be real careful here. I better be careful. Decibel is right there. Yes, she is, Bentley. Let's throw one right here. I'm gonna also throw another one. Well, I could probably just finish her off right now with a bomb. That'd probably be the smartest thing to do. Okay, that did not go where I wanted it to. Come on, make it there. Yes. Alright. I'm gonna jump down here and hide. I should have known it was you hideous hoodlums. Wait, how did she catch me? What? What, what, what? I don't believe that. Alright. I have to take this slow here. I can hear something scurrying around. Oh, bother. I'm probably just being paranoid. Yeah, just paranoid. Huge explosion, but just paranoid. Alright, one more here. Let's do these. Like I this this time. Decibel is right there. And can I land this one? I got an idea. Alright. I'm gonna quickly go all the way back up. Hide behind the books. Cause she's blind to see behind the books, apparently. These ones seem to be the best so far. No. Cyril? Cyril? Is that you? I do wish Cyril would hurry back. I love how Cyril, the paradox, and her are on the first name basis. I definitely heard something. You hear nothing. You hear nothing. I really hope it wasn't a mouse. Ooh, she's afraid of mice. Where's Penelope when we need her? Oh yeah, that's right. Oops, didn't mention her. And if you guys haven't noticed, oh, it's steady, Bentley. The picture, uh, not that. The picture on the Binocucom of Bentley, Penelope got a makeover. She looks so pretty. Alright, up we go here. I think we have a bomb out, so now we're gonna be in a little bit of a predicament here. Go all the way over here. No, oh, I did it again. Okay. The far one must have disappeared. So that's good. Hover over here quick, and we should be good with this one now. So I to get, need to get to that quarter show to have a clear shot at that transmitter. Bingo! Right on target. We probably could have just gave Salim the darts. And he could have just like stuck it on there for us before this all happened. But Bentley, you had to make this a little bit more complicated because you love showing off your hover chair. I understand. It's epic and awesome and cool. Oh shoot. Scorpions! Get back, you pest! Scorpions! I love how he's like just knows they're there. Scorpions are bound to be here somewhere. Detonate, there we are. And one more detonation, and we are good to go. Transmitter's in that corner, but it's blocked! I need to find a spot where I can see it. 
That's way up there. So... How are we gonna hit it from here? Actually, we probably can hit it right there. Yes! A direct hit! Alright, now I just have to activate those transmitters and get this party started! Bentley still loves that rock and roll. That type of music that soothes his shell. Salim will eat it whether hot or cold. With that old time of rock and roll. I hope your plan will work. Otherwise, I will be flattened like Peter Bray. Intolerable trash! Great work. She'll never guess there's a bug in that statue of her boyfriend. Okay, Salim, the bug is active. Now make tracks and fast! Noise illusion! Booyah, Salim. Job complete. Alright, everyone, it looks like the bug has been planted, and I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. Please remember to leave a comment, leave a rating, and subscribe for more Sly Cooper Thieves in Time. Have a great day, everyone.